Salamat Pagi. I am terribly sorry about the recent tragic loss of life in the Sulawesi earthquake. And I hope that people around the globe will come together to assist the survivors as they try to rebuild their lives and their homes. I'm speaking to you from the U.S. Holocaust Memorial Museum in Washington, D.C. The Holocaust is an event that had a profound effect on my life and the life of my family. And I appreciate the collaboration of the museum with UNESCO as they try to bring the history of the Holocaust to the people of Indonesia so as to try and prevent any event like the Holocaust from occurring again. I regret that I cannot be with you in person, but in many ways I feel very close because deep down in some ways I am Indonesian too. When I was about nine months old, I was left with an Indonesian family in Holland. My parents were deported. Fortunately, my mother survived 12 concentration camps, but my father died in a concentration camp and my two sisters, then only six and eight years old, were killed in Auschwitz. I was fortunate to be with the Madna family in Holland, and especially their babu, Mima Saina. And Mima Saina had a heart of gold. To them, it made no difference that I was Jewish. I was a young child needing a home and needing to be protected from the Nazis. The heroism of the Madna family and Mima Saina was recognized in a monument in Jerusalem that is dedicated to righteous among the nations. I have been to Indonesia once and I hope to come back and tell you my story in person and meet with all of you. In the meantime, I wish you all the best as you partake in this very important conference and bring the history of the Holocaust to people in Indonesia. Salamat Tingal.